<laughs> All right. Now, what about David? Remind us of, of your claim. Yeah, well, th this is Lee, and he's the hotel receptionist who confirmed that I was right that another guest had stolen my toast. Right. right. Where's the hotel? Uh, it was near Stroud. What were you doing in Stroud? I was filming the sitcom called Back. So, what happened? Well, I'm uh, going down for breakfast. I'm not, I'm not needed on set as much as I'd hoped. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'm there towards the end of the breakfast uh, slot. And on the buffet bit, there were only two bits of bread left in the sort of basket of sliced bread. Yes. Uh, and so I put them in the toaster and put the toast down. It was quiet in the breakfast room. And I'm, I go and get, I think, an orange juice and, you know, maybe a tea. Did they have any magnums? <laughs> That's what I like for breakfast. Did they have any magnums? Uh, no, no, they didn't no. stretch. <laughs> No, so. I know how you feel, Joe. When I listen to David talking, I want to shoot myself as well. <laughs> <laughs> so tell us some more about the bits and bobs you had for breakfast. <laughs> so I then turn round and the toast is not in the toaster and another guest is at another table eating toast. <gasps> <laughs> Cut to... It's a TV term. The next day... <laughs> I'm going down to breakfast about the same time. Another day when you're not needed on set? <laughs> <laughs> you know, but not needed first thing. You know, they were, they were getting to my scene. <laughs> and, well, what basically, happened? the same thing happened again. Oh, what? Oh. Really? The two slices I put in, yeah. I put the toast down, I turned my back for what felt like seconds, and there was this same guest. Same guest? Yeah, <gasps> different table he was at. So I f he's oh. playing with me. Why would you want to go to a different table? <laughs> I say to the man, excuse me, but you're eating my toast. I put that bread in there and you're eating it. Can I just and ask one question? Can you promise us faithfully that there isn't a third day in this story? <laughs> <laughs> So you confronted the man quite out of character, I might say. Well, I, I, but he did, this was the second day in a row. Yes. Right. And, and he was quite aggressive. Oh. He said, what are you talking about? This is my toast. Don't be ridiculous. So what did you say? I, was, I became, if you can imagine such a thing, more pathetic. <laughs> 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 now, when, when does... When, are we going to get to the point where this man enters your story? <laughs> it's the last day of my stay, so I'm checking out. I go back to my room, I get my bag, I come down to reception. Mm. And there is Lee, ah, the star yeah. of the story, but quite a late entrant. <laughs> he says to me, um, as I'm checking out, excuse me, I couldn't help overhearing your conversation in the breakfast room. And I have to say that you are absolutely right. And he shows me the CCTV. No, <laughs> no, he, no, he doesn't, David. <laughs> he shows me. <laughs> he shows you the, the CCTV <laughs> from the breakfast room. <laughs> and you've seen me, slightly grainy, put toast in the toast and put it down, yes. move away. And then this other guy, when the toast pops up, he takes it. Okay, so. Yeah. Is there anything else? No! In this <laughs> Just let me recap. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we need an answer. So, Lee's team. Is Lee Joe's flattened friend, Lucy's plunging pedestrian, or David's hotel hero? What do we think? Well, I'm trying to visualise him in all these situations, and to me, the most realistic one seems like falling down a hole. He doesn't look like he works in a hotel. I mean, I, I what don't do you, know why, why, why does he look like he works in a hotel? <laughs> um... <laughs> <laughs> well, because I've been to lots of hotels and I've mm. never seen anyone <laughs> that looks like him. I think it's I think it's Lucy. You think it's Lucy? What do you think, Lee? I think it, I think it might be the golf. The golf. Admitting to large-scale criminality on primetime TV. I don't 15, think it's criminality. 15-year-old driving a truck around a golf course. A 12-year-old can drive a, a, a motorised quad bike. Can they? Well, I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> you both think it's Lucy. I think it's Joe, but I will go with Lucy. OK, Lee, would you please reveal your true identity? I'm Lee, and...
Joe and I <laughs> run each other over. Yes, Lee is Joe's flattened friend. Thank you very much, Lee.